Welcome to another video, TDX. So uh, today we have done a pretty big rebalance update. Uh, these six towers right here, including Ranger to start our tower. Barracks has also been increased from limit four to seven. So uh, have fun spamming that, but it only applies in solo. So yes, now if you play solo, duo, or trio, the limits do increase or decrease. And as you can see, these two have been buffed. Worship has just received a $2,000 decrease price and farm as well has received a slight price decrease on its placement, making it well cheaper to afford now. So a pretty big thing about Rangers that uh, not only has the DPS been overall increased and just overall cheaper. I mean, uh, take a look at these upgrades. They've just been overall uh, made more price. And look at that. This was 3000. This was, I think, 12,000 before. And now we made it less than 10,000. And then uh, operator over here, when you max out to goes, he now gets 150 DPS. And we increase his range slightly to be 23. Bottom path operator. Overall, just better DPS on the lower levels. And uh, even on the max, he now gets 120 DPS. His burst has also been increased to be uh, wider now. So probably one of the biggest changes to the beginner experience is that, well, we made Ranger able to pierce armor now, ignore bullet resistance, and he actually does a pretty fair job at doing that when he first arrives. So now Ranger can be used as a counter to armored zombies, making it a pretty worthwhile tower as the beginner tower. Also, Grenade has been buffed overall uh, to now have less of a cooldown. Then when you max upgrade it, it'll be 10 seconds. So a 10 second cooldown to just lob down another grenade. And yes, he has been made cheaper as well to go ahead and uh, get it sooner. Anyways, as for Missile Trooper, he has been overall buffed. Uh, look at that price, $1,000. And the optic stock is made cheaper. The small plus is made cheaper as well. Bigger Warhead is cheaper. And Javelin does more damage, giving you a lot more uh, value for the price you just placed down. Oh, and I also give him a bit more range as well. As you see, uh, this is a pretty huge range right here. Almost as big as your mom. And then there's into Carl. Bigger Splash has been made cheaper as well. And MR has been rebounds overall just be better offering 166 splash dps while being uh, overall cheaper we're gonna go to work at this huge order i think rangers oh man we just did a thousand damage with that singular grenade throw and the fire look at the fire damage just going up we did increase the fire just a tad bit not too much thanks to grenade cooldown throw down another one boom and yeah this is this is pretty good now probably the biggest part about this update is that uh barracks has been uh buffed a lot now you can now place down not four not five not even six but seven barracks you can place down if you play solo if you play in quad it'll still be four which is still higher than before because we only put a limit of three but yeah look at barracks gaming going on However, there's a slight nerf to the barracks to how we change it to work. So when the troops go... Oh yeah, I was going to spawn in a lot of troops. Yeah, I was going to do this manually, you guys. Like I was saying, so let's say you have like a giant army. They won't all stay in the same place. They will all move up to find room, quote unquote room. Then to move up and start, and start firing. This kind of puts down a uh, huge nerf on that. So you don't farm like these super OP giant walls. Which I do like walls. It's just, it, it, it's just that there's a there's a limit on them. Yeah, I don't think Barracks is gonna save us now. <laughs> I think we are screwed. Come on, Barracks, true spawn. <laughs> oh my, I want to try out Barracks again real quick. Hold on. So Path Two is pretty OP and can really stress test TDX, I guess, because uh, well, look how much stuff it spawns. Out. That's a that's quite a handful. You get two scout level twos, one M202, one rider, one flamethrower, and that's, well, multiplied by seven of us. And as you can see, yeah, they're all going to start spawning. You get a pretty big army. I did want to allow a higher limit before, but we really wanted to make sure that this new nerfing stack we did is uh, okay to do. And I'll show you more on what that means now. Got all these riders. <laughs> anyway, so when the wall starts forming, as you can see, some troops are walking through them to be within range. That's because they can no longer stack in the exact same area. They need to move up to the front line or they can fire the back as they please. Look at some of the flamethrowers. They're not within uh, the, I guess, free room range per se. They need to move up more. But yeah, this is with uh, seven barracks and uh, we're all of the line pretty uh well oh never mind the boss are just squishing all of them yeah i really wish we could nerf this because this is what makes it really hard to balance on certain maps 
the line of sight, you know, it is uh, this thing where towers cannot fire through the wall because, you know, there's a wall. But these troops ignore it. The main reason why we did that is because, well, if we impose that on these troops, it would cause massive lack performance because it doesn't work well with moving objects like this. Only standstill would be appropriate. So that would be a good nerf, but unfortunately I can't do that. Ah, oh, you're OP now. But uh, with, with, this, with this wall stacking nerf, it makes it a bit better. I do need to increase that a bit because I think it's too low right now. It's highly experimental right now, okay? These these changes are not final. The way they, the way they spread out, maybe even more later on. Oh, man, that's a lot of... <laughs> oh, yeah, it's Barax Gaming. Barax Gaming right here. It is such a hard tower to balance. Oh, my God. Legit, annoying cows and Sky Island were nerfed to the ground in terms of how they were rated because of this one tower. But, yeah, I never really hated Brax. It's just that we had to nerf it temporarily uh, while we got this uh, smart nerf wall stack inbound, which might be an increase later. Oh, yes. Cow annoyance. Yeah, I wonder how annoying cow looks like with, uh, seven barracks. Hold on, I'm gonna get some rail troopers too. Yeah, rail troopers now spawn in a pair. We have lowered their health. Slightly as you can see, 600 health as well. They spawn in a pair. Yeah, this was the meta where you just, uh, have them stay right here. They just become gods. We kind of fixed that a bit. What also makes annoying cow so good is that, well, you just have a lot of space to place down your stuff in the back, so it doesn't really matter too much about in here. Oh yeah, I forgot, they can just walk over here. Why did Ryder stop right up there? You're, you're gonna die faster. Ooh, shocker stunning, all of that. But the thing is that barrack troops are not targeted as of now to be hit by any sort of zombies. Man, we're, uh, that's a lot of fellas on the, on the map right now. I'm surprised uh, we're getting no what. Oh my God, I just multiplied everything. Hey man, I don't think Burax is good. You are just spawning more troops. Call in the reinforcements. Call in the reinforcements. Three predators. Why is Fave here? Oh man, I'm spawning in so many troops. Look at this. Look at the amount of troops. I don't think it's gonna be enough because of the wall stacking nerf. No, the bosters are just coming right through. Gotta get some lives. Two hundred thousand health just small. Oh no, no. <laughs> I <laughs> see we have we have lost a line uh, probably need to get some MRLs out just to help them out a bit but man the shockers are not having with us uh we're gonna Carl actually those are not bad yeah we are just taking L's right now uh fellas I'm not gonna lie oh 200,000 I've lost hey at least I got 92 gold though so so we up all right just place some my last max out javelins time to see what we can do to miss the revive plague doctor oh my god Dude, his health is going down faster than the 2008 recession. This is crazy. <laughs> oh, they're on all the barracks, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> and the challenge is just beating him. They're beating him. <laughs> I'm so good at my game, you guys. Man, I'm so pro. Winners. Only five minutes. Can anyone beat that? I don't think so. Five minutes, y'all. But yeah, this uh, rebalance update is mostly to prepare for a uh, bigger update. I'm aware that the few past updates have just been skins and, well, now re rebalances, but it's all for the greater good. For what I have planned next is uh, these, these uh, buff changes won't look that much to them.